What are you saying guys, it's Richie Merckx and today we've got a little blind dating series It's called Thumbs Up, Thumbs Down as you read by the title, this shit is gonna be lit So this ain't no primary school Thumbs Up, Thumbs Down How this works is there will be one girl and three boys They will be asked a bunch of questions and that will show their compatibility Then at the end they will have to put their thumbs up if they like the person And if they dislike the person, thumbs down Like the fact that I can't cook was a problem for her to get it. The winner will get a gift card to any restaurant of their choice. Yes, yes, people, it's your boy JP. Um, South London, and yeah, man, she's here to have fun in there. Alright, so why do you think that you will win today? Well, they call me HP like the sauce. So they call me JP with the sauce as well. So okay. that's obviously why I think I'm gonna win. Okay. Right? The sauce, that's all I've got to say. <laughs> My name's Luke, also known as LK from East. I'm just here to find a goal. Alright, so why do you think you will win today? Well, I feel like I would win mainly because truthful, honest, literally just say how it is. My name is Richard, I'm from East and I'm just here innit, I'm trying to look for a girl. So why do you think you'll win today? Oh, uh, man's got the, the laughs, got confidence and obviously I just show that a girl's good time innit? Yeah. Uh, hey guys, I'm Chantal, I'm 21 and I'm from Ken. Today I'm looking for a man to take me on a date because I'm tired of these useless men. <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, Chantal, can you cook? Yeah, I can cook. What is it you can cook? Anything you want. Straight on. Yeah. What's your favourite dish? Oh, like something Italian, isn't it? Italian? Mm. Mm. So you wait, you can't cook in it? Nah. That is tough. So what do you think about that? <sighs> I don't I don't really like men who can't cook. I just feel like you are lazy. So. Spit some bars. The guy, you spit a poem to Chantel. Like something directed towards her and a cappella off the top. Chantel, she's a sweet one. Yeah, I really wanna meet one. Oh. And you know that she got the nice one, got nice curves, yeah. She might be the right one. Mm. Understand, yeah, she's just a beauty. Beauty. Ghana, beauty, yeah, she's a cutie. Mm. What are you saying? Come on now. I mean, I like that a lot. Is he winning Ten you stars. is he winning you over? Yeah, he is. The girl has to tell the guy a pickup line. Do you have a name or can I call you mine? Ooh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling that one still. Mm, I'm feeling that one still. Okay, you feeling that one? Yeah, I'm feeling definitely that. using that one. Yeah, I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm definitely, I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I might use that still. Have you cheated in a relationship before? No. No. Why did you hesitate? <laughs> <laughs> Why did you hesitate? I didn't hesitate. Yeah, I answered before you did. Yeah, because I was waiting for you to answer, you took a long time to answer. Oh, well, so down. I was, I was processing that question. Okay. Actually. Okay. Okay. Does drip matter? Ladies first. Yeah. Like, Why? Drip in what sense? Like, I just want someone who can dress good. You know, you don't have to be head to toe designer, but if you have, you know, a good sets of style, you can put outfits together. Mm. That's all that matters. Cause okay. I can't just take you home to my parents and you don't have to dress. <laughs> Facts. Uh, what, the uncle thing is that what you're, is that what you're saying? Not even just uncle. Like, you just don't look well. Bro okay. got the drip look. Come nah, on, nah, nah, no nah, disrespect. Nah, don't, don't, don't say it like that. No, nah, I, I hear you on that one. I feel like drip does matter because if you don't have a sense of style in yourself, then I'm sorry, you can't be for me still. Like, I can't have a girl wearing fucking. Um, are you allowed to swear? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, cool. I can't have a girl wearing, you know, flip flops and then Gucci now, man. You gotta have a sense of style still. What is a fun random fact about you? Ladies first. Um, I can break a watermelon with my this bit. No, you can't. Yeah, How? I can. Yeah, I can. Get me a watermelon. I'll show you. My arm. Her arm. The bit that like, bends. Yeah. So, so, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she, yeah, she, yeah. So, so, she, yeah, she's strong. She's strong. Wait, let me see your muscles. Are you? You know what they say? Woman with a strong arm, good in the kitchen. Yeah. Cook up the dishes. Cook up the dishes. You get me? Cook up the dishes. Yes, man. She's got some good dishes. Good dishes. Good dishes. Them good dishes. Don't do that. Don't do that. See women belong in the kitchen. <laughs> did, that, did it come out my mouth? Did no. Did, did it come out my mouth? No. Uh, next question, next question, next question. Liar. The girl, Chantel, you have to tell Richard a pickup line. Oh my goodness, okay. Are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. <laughs> what do you think about that, man? That was no words, fam. No words, fam. <laughs> Sorry, I don't. 
I don't do pickup lines to men. They should be doing it to me. I'm so sorry. Spit some bars. Freestyle. <laughs> City girls thing. Come on. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let Off the top. Let me hear, let me hear. Acapella, no beat. Okay, cool. <clears throat> You're moving mad. What that, did that even mean? Mm. Chat to my girl Charlene. Okay. And you think that she won't tell me. Okay. Big man, please stay humble. Big man. Say it with your chest, don't mumble. Mm. Really with the feet like fumble. Move like Mr. Tumble. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? Do you want to change career or something like that? <laughs> car, I'm can't lie. I'm not feeling that still. So I'm gonna fall. <laughs> well, I'm not a rapper, so it's fine. Yeah. Is your body count under ten? Yes. Liar. <laughs> <laughs> Mission failed. We'll get up next time. Bro. It's under oh. ten, yeah. Yeah. What is it? Under ten. It's under ten, fam. It's nine, isn't it? No cap. Does he look like he's lying? Bro, I'm not lying. Isn't he? I said nine. No. <laughs> I'm not lying. So what? If a guy's body count is under ten, is that good or bad? Like, do you care? Do you know what it is? I would like a guy's body count to be under four, but you know, in this generation, it's never gonna happen. So four. It is At twenty-one what it is. years old. Four. Yeah. I can't lie. I'm shocked at four. Yeah. Four. It is. <laughs> <laughs> What's your ideal date? My ideal date would be, it wouldn't be like a dinner thing, but it would probably be after. My ideal date would be probably go out arcade, bowling, like something active so I get to know the person better. I like that. Like um, that. What about you? My ideal date would be a spontaneous trip to a country other than England and do something fun. <laughs> Oh, you, you can fly her out to another country, yeah? Yeah. yeah you're on that, yeah? I'll be on this. I'll be on Come it. on. I'll be on this. Okay, let's see your money situation. Does money matter to you? What, me? Yeah, yeah. Money definitely matters. Um, I have plans of being stinking rich, so... And Ooh. I'm ambiguous Come on, come on, well. come on, come on. You know what I'm saying? I'm ambiguous as well, so if you're not on my level in terms of the money thing, it's a bit long still, because... Uh, what level are you on? Huh? He said you're not on your level. Like, what, what, what level are you on? Come on, you have I'm to match his I'm, level. I'm, I'm, I'm on my own level, so I don't know. I feel like maybe the question is, can he match my level? I don't think I can match your level. I mean, I've got dreams, aspirations, making my money here and there, three, four sources of income. So it's, it's all right. It's calm. Okay. Nice. All legal, by the way. No, not legal. <laughs> still, just I just had to get that out the window. Does money matter? Yeah. Why? 100% because like part of dating is going out and doing things together, do you know what I'm saying? Like you can't really be sitting at your yard. You can't be sitting at your yard or your mum's yard if you live with your mum still. Yeah, I'd just be doing that every time, shouting your girl at like midnight, you see what I'm saying? If you're with that person, then you value their time and money's quite important in a relationship, buying presents on a birthday, Christmas. Word, 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 word. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? All right, all right. So what do you think about that? I like that. I, I do like that. Um, I feel like when it comes to the money conversation, a lot of men feel very insecure and I don't know why. Um, I do feel like money is a, a big factor in a relationship. It's not the most important thing on its own, but you definitely need money to be dating because it, it is expensive to have someone there, go on dates, buy them gifts, all of that. So yeah, it is important. Height preference. <laughs> What's your height preference? Um, somebody who's over five nine, five ten. Five nine, five ten. That's my my minimum. What do you think about that? What's your height, man? My height. Don't mean to say my height. <laughs> yeah, you're you're on a date with her, bro. Ah, right, cool. My height, five nine. Much five nine. Are you sure? Yes, okay. I'm sure. So, okay, cool. I'm five two. So, do you have a preference? Anything smaller than me. Okay, cool. I like my men over five to uh, ten. Don't mean to say my hat. <laughs> five ten. Five nine, five ten. How tall are you? Five two. Cool. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> nah, I'm calm in it. I'm six foot. Obviously, people say I'm all, uh, taller than that, but um, yeah, like, that's calm. For me, I don't really have a height preference. I just don't want a girl that's taller than me, in it. Okay. Are you a traditional? Woman. No, I don't think I am. I can do the standard cook, clean, all of that, but when it gets to like the proper housewife, 
type of values because I'm going to work, you know. Okay. So. Are you a traditional man? When it comes down to it, I'll say, yeah. Obviously, if it's a, a two week ten as well, I can do half. I'm um, partner can do half, like, it's one of those ones. So, what do you think about that? Like, do you want a traditional woman, bro? I would say it doesn't really matter as long as the person is like, I would say, knows and, and is also a good, like, good hearted person as well. So, it's just good level of mind and everything. Alright, okay. so do you want a traditional one? Um, yes and no. Yes, because. Like what like, do you, what do you think a traditional man does in it? Like he's basically the provider and he does everything apart from like domestic stuff. Mm. But I don't want to just be the one doing domestic stuff. I want to do what a traditional man would do also. So that's why I say yes because the providing thing I need to do all of that. But I don't want to just do domestics if that makes sense. So you want him to be traditional, but you don't want to be traditional. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Final one. Get to know each other for like two minutes, and then you know. Do you drive? Pardon? Do you drive? No, nah, I've got my driver. I'm getting my driver's license and stuff. Okay. What is that bad? Uh, you're getting it, so that's calm. Yeah. If I'm you getting... weren't doing nothing, then yeah, that'd be. Probably... Nah, don't worry. I'm getting stuff. Get to know each other. Describe each other's looks because you can't see each other. Do you have hair? Look, <laughs> 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 do you have um, I can cook. I can cook like Italian dishes, Caribbean dishes. Um, yeah, I'm at uni, so I'm studying games design, so I had to create games. Oh, you actually? Yeah. Like, do you have like a low trim or like dreads that like, twist? Yeah, no. Nah, obviously, I've got I've got hair. It's low, so low cut. Okay. Yeah, like, I'm quite tall. Um, yeah, not obviously. Like, well, not obviously, but yeah, I'm black. So I don't know what else you want to know. Do you get it? <laughs> do you know how to cook? Yeah, I do. What can you cook? Um, actually, wait, no. First of all, where are you from? I'm from Ghana, where are you from? Man, I'm from Ghana as well, you know? You're lying. No, 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 no. Do you know how to speak what country? Yeah, I do. Uh, but, mm. but, but it's, it sounds too English, so I don't do it. Alright, let me hear English. some tree then, let me hear some tree. I can't. Why? I'm embarrassed myself, I can't do it here. Okay, so you're not here. <laughs> um, so I'm small. Yeah. Um, small as in what? Like I'm fatty. Mm -hmm. Quite petite. I've, I'm petite but with a curve, so yeah. my body's quite nice. Yeah. Um, my hair's currently red. And yeah. I'm black. Okay. What do you do for a living? Um, I'm currently a computer science undergraduate and I'm a content creator. Okay. And I have my own sneaker business. Okay, facts. Yeah, How about well, you? I work at um, JD Sports and I. <laughs> 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 Alright, time, 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 time. Do you like black boys? Yeah. Dark skins. Yeah. Alright, say nothing. Alright, um, <laughs> two, six foot plus, like six three, very built, muscular. Um, do you like that? Beards, do you like beards? No. You don't like beards? Mm -mm. So you want a baby face? Yeah. Mad, okay, cool. Um, do you know that guy that won the Oscar, Daniel Kaluuya? Yeah. Yeah, bad people say I look like him still. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, you, okay. you see it in it. You see it. Yeah, you see it in it. I was gonna you say see it in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Low key, still. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Okay, spin. Hey. <laughs> so, what do you have to say, man? I don't you... have anything to say. I thought I'd give him a chance, but obviously, it didn't really work out. Oh, do you know it was you getting on to me about cooking, innit? Yeah, well, why can you not cook? Because I just get takeaway, I've got the money for it. <sighs> Ooh, <you're> scary. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we got one. There's still one more left, so. Okay. You might... That one is not gonna happen, don't worry. She you you might lose your girl, bro. <laughs> what do you mean I might lose my girl? <laughs> Would you pick him over the first one? Um. Ooh. I think I need to know them a little bit more because the other guy is a little bit more cheeky. Okay, so you want another round or something? Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Do you think you'll win? Yeah, I thought I was like, very confident. I like the way she's like, 
She's confident with herself. She very knows what she wants, and that's a good woman to actually uh, be with because if she knows what she wants, then everything will go smoothly and it's very out there. You know what I mean? Uh, I like Luke. Luke was he's very calm, seems very pure, just kind, like genuinely kind, friendly. He seems really shy though, but I feel like once you get to know him, maybe he'll do a little bit more. But yeah, I liked him. I did like him. Do you think that you'll win? Or? Yep, because the other guy don't have the sauce. Like I said, I'm JP <laughs> with the sauce. Um, I like the fact that she's Ghanaian and I like the fact that we can vibes. But she said that Ghanaian men are cheeky. I'm not cheeky, so I promise you, I'm not going to give you any what I like if you, if you choose me. That's all I've got to say. Um, JP was funny, um, very cheeky. Um, I like that he was Ghanaian. But at the same time, I didn't because Ghanaian men can be a bit... You know, they like to show a lot of love to begin with, then after they just something clicks and they just turn mad. <laughs> so, yeah, apart from that, he was good vibes. Mr. JG Sports. Yeah. So, you basically turned her down. Yeah. Why? There's a few reasons, isn't it? I think that personalities, I can already feel the vibe, you get what I'm saying? And I think there'll be a lot of clashing going on in the future over. Um, <laughs> issues that that don't really need to be brought up do you get it like the fact that i can't cook was a problem for her do you get it yeah and when i'm at home yeah i want to put my feet up you know what i'm saying i want to smoke i want my food put on the table hey. like i'm a traditional <laughs> man you get it you get what i'm saying and obviously if there's no woman there for me to do that then that's not for me fam last richard the one that works in jd um, he was funny um, I didn't like that he can't cook cause that really upset me um, I don't really have much to say about him apart from I didn't like that he couldn't cook okay so wait why did you put your thumbs up for all of them so the first one I put my thumbs up because I thought okay fair enough you can't cook but you seem like a nice person to get to know so that's why I put my thumbs up second person he's cheeky like I like cheeky men I feel like they'll keep me on my toes a little bit mm -mm. Um, the third one is like from what I've seen so far is like the opposite of me and I kind of like that because I'm quite um, out there so to have someone who's like the opposite it's nice kind of kind of keeps me level so. so Tell now has to pick with the guy that she wants to go on a date with because to be fair why are you even here to be fair you kind of got a move because you denied it already <laughs> that's true you know. so in a bit. Nice meeting you still. Me too. <laughs> so we got two. <laughs> oh yeah, you can ask them a question. Okay, you have three guesses. Which one of these makes me the most happiest? Are you ready? Shoes, money, makeup. You can go first. Well, obviously you've got a shoe business, right? So it could be shoes and obviously you're a girl, so I'm just gonna say girls automatically like wait makeup, so I'm just gonna put that one there. So I'm gonna go for a gamble and say shoes okay. because you've got a sneaker business, so you must be a sneakerhead. Okay. That's what I'm gonna say. Money then. Money. Got money. Literally, money makes anyone happy. I wanna say it makes anyone happy, but necessities basically. Yeah, yeah, he has a ring, so he's materialistic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one, no, what no, no. you said money? <laughs> yeah. Gift, gift. Wow, mm -hmm. wow, wow, wow. wow. All right, the he's right. answer was money. All right, you know what? Let's do let's do three questions, just to make sure one person wins. So Brother. do the same thing, cause that was good. Okay. And like we do it twice, two more times. Is sex a big thing in a relationship? Nope. Big cat. Big man, Explain. I'll explain. Wait, wait. Let's get your No, because like. Me personally, sex is just, I would say it's just a bonus to the relationship, if you get what I mean. Like, it's not the main, it's not the necessity. It's about actually knowing the person better, building with the person. So I would say sex is not. It is not um, I agree with him to an extent um, because obviously you need that kind of companionship in a relationship. Personally, my personal opinion sex isn't really like the most important thing it's more of you know spending time with the person getting to know the person you know seeing their um flaws seeing their you know how they are behind closed doors because you know appearances can be 
a whole other thing. But I still do think it's important because, you know, sex wasn't invented. Sex wouldn't have been invented if it had if it didn't have a use, right? So obviously sex has its importance, but obviously it's not as important in a relationship, in my personal opinion. Okay, so both people said the same thing. Do you one more question then innit? Yeah, Make it a good question. <laughs> Come on, man. Why are you? Why are you so? No, Joe. Joe is. Yeah, don't come. I'm that good. Question, yeah. Yeah. Okay, which one do you think I prefer, Jordan ones or Jordan fours? I'll say Jordan fours. Yeah, I'm gonna lie, it's fours. And I'll say because Jordan fours because like Jordan J ones are just a little bit rinsed out. If you know what I mean. It's not even that they're rinsed. It's because it's not really for. I, I, and I don't mean this in no like offense. Yeah, it's not really meant for. Shut up! Shut up! Shut the fuck up! It's not really meant for shorter people. If you get what I'm trying to say. Jordan fours are more because I see a lot of more sh shorter yeah, people yeah. buying. It's not a violation. Yeah, yeah. It's not a violation. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm being. I'm being honest. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna be honest and lie just to come and see your. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, I'm gonna be honest and lie. That's what I'm gonna say. Okay. Yeah, I just go, listen, listen, we've got the score, we know who's answered the most right in it, but it's up to Chantel at the end of the day, so you can pick right now. So the person I'm going to pick, I'm going to pick because they got majority of the questions right, and I think I just prefer their vibe right now. The person I'm going to pick is... Hey. Mission failed. Let's get him next time. Come on, man, exchange contacts and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like Instagram, whatever. Off camera. Man said off camera. You, off you won. No, oh, you, let me give you the gift card as well. Wait, wait, we got the gift card coming. So, we have a restaurant gift card, you know what I'm saying? We got Nando's on there, Z's on there. Uh, yo, we just bear stuff is on there anyway, so this goes to the man you know you gotta take out your girl still are you using it for yourself or no, 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 no. will you actually it. take her out i'll take her out i'll take her out okay yeah. so where are you gonna take her like go in the car like come on now as i said where is it as well as uh, what's the I... restaurant man show the restaurant which restaurant i'm seeing nando's i'm seeing us uh, which one which one yeah the, the all too basic i'll be so rude like nando's is a rare isn't it mm -hmm. Nando's is a rare it depends if like you got any other places i can go to mm. Man said, this, this is oh, not, said a 15 pound oh, gift card for Hakkasan. Don't worry, don't worry, you might share Hakkasan. Alright, so how did you feel, man? You lost. Nah, I didn't lose, man, don't worry. I mean, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Listen, man didn't lose, innit? She just, best man wins, innit? I just have to be sportsman, but all I gotta say is she don't like cheeky guys, so we can never, you know, she, she weren't really on my wavelengths, that's all I gotta say. So. Yeah, it happens, man. There's yeah. a girl out there for everyone, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, don't worry, I got things like lined up, so. <laughs> Hey. Shut the fuck up! Hey. Yeah, do you feel like you made the right decision? Yeah, I do feel like I made the right decision. Obviously, hearing JP just now, obviously he's got things. So, yeah, I'm very happy that I picked Luke. <laughs> <laughs> so don't forget to like and subscribe. We're going to be updating you guys on how the date goes as well. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you like and subscribe. That's it. Write down in the comments below who you want to see next as well.